my name is Alvin Oscar Lafleur. I'm from Lake Charles, Louisiana. Uh, something unique about me is uh, I have three sisters, two nephews. Uh, I actually want to be like a, uh, on a training facility. I want to uh, work with kids, uh, mainly like high school and middle school kids, training them. Uh, I just like, uh, I just want to tell them about like what I went through in college and stuff like that and just like what to look forward to and stuff just so they can be prepared for uh, like what we go through here. Uh, going back down south. Louisiana, man. What's, what's up with the food scene in Louisiana? It's got to be pretty good down there. Right? Yeah, it, it, it's great. I ain't going to lie. It's great. Uh, some of the best uh, local food in down there? Uh, po' Boys, uh, Crawfish, A2 Faith. I would say okra gumbo too. My grandma would make the uh, best one. Uh, I actually like playing the game. And sometimes when I'm at home, I go crabbing and fishing and stuff. I just like getting out, doing stuff like that. I like getting on the water, getting on the boat or something, catch me some fish. Uh, probably a speedboat, I like those. But I just want to chill in the middle of somewhere where I can just relax and catch me some fish. I never, I never went fishing out here before though, actually. Uh, Willie was supposed to take me, but it, it never happened because it's always cold. I mean, it's hot right now, so it'd be the perfect time, but uh, I don't know. Willie never cooked up shrimp for me, so. Jake Gillian's telling us that he's cooking shrimp all the time. I, that's his roommate. I used to stay next to him, actually, but I ended up moving like uh, this semester, so never really got no food from him. He cooked a... Uh, a steak for me one time, I think. That was about it, though. Uh, yeah, uh, Brody, he was really like a smart guy, so I, I really want to improve in that area and become a lot smarter, like with our defense. Um, he made a lot of plays for us. Uh, that guy was just had pure instincts, actually. Like he was everywhere the ball was, and I just want to improve in that area. And I think like watching him play, like he come to the sideline, tell me some things I need to look out for, and that really helped me like with uh, how I played last year. And Vince was a guy like just physical and just made plays like, so I really just looked up to him cause like Vince make a play, you want to make a play too. So it, it really kind of, his play kind of rubbed off on everybody else like in the secondary. Like, cause we all like in the meeting room, we get to talking about it and he'd be like, I made this play, I made this play. So you, everybody else in the room want to make plays so you could talk about it in the meeting room. Uh, I actually think Coach Reed gonna push us to be uh, the best that we can be because he don't let us slack in anything we do. 